<laughs> Sorry, I just left at some. Yo, what's going on, guys? It's me, the Ninja Reviewer here. Welcome to my review for you anime fans alike. Greetings once again for Ruby Volume 5 Chapter 2. Oh, yo, this episode was crazy. Yo, where do I even start with this? Okay, so first things first, let's talk about the awesome sauce which was Weiss. Weiss got an upgrade, man. Her upgrade is so cool. So it's not just that she can like summon ice, but she could summon fire. She could summon lasers. It was like, yo, yeah, it's my girl. That was so cool. Yo, that scene looked really well done. I loved that scene. It was so clean. It was so fresh. I loved the way she was using that against all those bugs. That was actually really amazing to actually see her like improve. So you could tell that after you know being separated from the team, her training has gotten a lot more better, a lot more improved. Oh man, yo, that was so cool. That was like my favorite part of the episode right there. Well, one of my favorite, yeah, pretty much my favorite part was just seeing the development of how much Weiss has grown. And we actually get to see that, you know, with the incoming attacks that were going on, especially when those uh, bug drone things are actually going after her. Uh, that was cool. That part right there, that action sequence looked so beautiful it looks so well done i am glad the production value went up and what i'm really happy about is that these episodes are not just going to be like 15 minutes long or maybe a little bit below 15 minutes 10 minutes whatever 12 minute episodes yo they're going the extra mile let's go they're going for the 20 minute mark episodes i hope they keep continuing with this trend because the longer these episodes are the more content we can get and i think by that we can finally you know progress this season a lot better compared to what season four has done or volume four whatever so yeah so hopefully this will you know help it finally potential especially because the progression or the story progression wise was pretty big in this one so you know we have that going on so yeah so we have that going on and also the other scene as well where we got the um professor lionheart you know visiting up once again with cinder and then uh that other dude i forget his name uh, the one that, you know, works, you know, with Cinder, you know, seeing her go back to her old ways, you know, her evil ways and stuff like that. That was cool. Like, I like the way that she is in this episode, especially because she seems more like an awesome, more powerful threat than we realize. You know, just, you know, having that conversation with those two is actually pretty cool as well. And then we move on to the biggest part of this episode. Now, after that, of course, I am going to talk about the ending to this episode as well. Oh, my God. Bro, oh my god. Dude, okay. So, apparently, we have Adam who meets up with the ruler, which is Farah Or Fyra. Fyra? Fyra? Of course, if you guys remember, Adam is the, or pretty much most of the, or most of the people who are involved with the White Fang. So, go in there basically saying that, look, you know what? You may be an all-powerful ruler, but your way of actually controlling this country is is not good enough it is obviously not the way it's supposed to be i'm the one that should be running shit you should be the one that should be stepping down but you know putting it in, in layman's terms it's pretty much how it goes so pretty much he doesn't like the way things are going with her so basically it's like okay look you know what this is what we thrive for like look you know what i think because my ways of ruling is is fine i mean it's keeping you know things in check while with you it's basically you know, always, you know, for vengeance and, and, and violence and pretty much, you know, stuff like that. So, and then I'm like, dude, Adam just walks in there like a boss. Just walking. This dude's just walking. And then all of a sudden, he's right close to her. Bam! Just stabs her and she's dead. Like, literally, she's dead. She's dead! She's dead! She's dead! 
Jeez, <laughs> Dude, damn. it's crazy. Oh, man. It's insane. So, with that happening going on, then, the very end of this episode that I really did enjoy was Raven. Yo, ooh, Raven. 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 Knocking out Weiss. And she's like, really? You come to this island? Bitch. Ooh. And then just like stomps Weiss to the ground. And then Weiss is pretty much knocked the fuck out. So that's it for Weiss. So Weiss is out at least for now. But, you know, we still got a lot of things going up. So overall, when it comes to this episode of Ruby, I will say when it comes to this episode, though, there were a lot of cool moments. Like my favorite, of course, being the Weiss stuff. And especially the very end on the way things, you know, ended off. And then, of course, you know, we got the coolness of Adam. I mean, yeah, at the beginning, you know, a, a lot of craziness just went down. This definitely right here has to be one of my favorite episodes so far in Volume 5. Because, oh, man, yo, was this episode crazy. Like, it was the most insane episode we've gotten in, like, years. And it's like, oh, Jesus Christ, dude. All right, I'm done, I'm done. So this episode, I'm definitely giving, or chapter, I should give it, a five out of five. This was definitely a five out of five worthy chapter. Loved it, loved it, loved it. Compared to what we got from the beginning of the first chapter, this 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 was amazing. This was, yo, like I couldn't believe my man Adam. She just, he just stabbed the bitch, I was crazy. Dude, oh my god, and Raven, oh my god, I mean, I can't see chapter 3 yet, because now that it's on YouTube, I know every other person can, who goes to freaking Rooster Teeter, if you're subscribed to them, it's already out on there, but I'm waiting at least for YouTube to get it, so I can, like, watch it easily, because I am late to the party, but still, oh my god, this is crazy, uh, especially Weiss, the Weiss part was so sick, animation was so smooth, it was on point, or the CGI, or the program that they used, do the 3D was spot on, on point. It was just amazing overall. Each season, it looks like they are improving the graphic capabilities and it just looked great. One day, though, I would love a 2D animated Ruby series. I mean, hey, if they're already doing a 2D model for uh, Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle, I really do want an actual 2D model anime style. Especially what we saw back in the first chapter with the uh, the village, the, the little background stuff. That was cool. I wish we had that kind of 2D animation, though, for Ruby at times. But only only one day we could tell. So anyways, that's it. I'm done. Give me your thoughts in the comment section below of this uh, chapter of Ruby uh, Volume 5. And that's it. See you guys next week. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. As always, click the bell to join the squad to get notifications on my videos. Also, do not forget to check out my social media plugins, gamer tags as well. Peace, soul, love, chicken grease, and the sky is the limit. And my manga fans keep supporting what you watch. And that's it.